Hey, welcome back, folks. When UFC President Dana White told KH12 Sports Director Rob DeMello earlier this month that the UFC did not have a venue to bring an event to Hawaii, it seemed to give a TKO to hopes of a hometown throwdown for featherweight champion Max Holloway and the 50th state. A Hawaii state senator says, not so fast. The organization is very interested in making a pit stop here in the Pacific. District 15 Senator Glenn Wakai told KH12 Sports today that Aloha Stadium has assured the UFC that an overhang cover would prevent any rain from hitting fighters and the crowd of a potential event. That's also a spring or summer date for a pay-per-view card at Aloha Stadium heavily in the works, despite what we heard from Dana White. Well, last week, Tuesday, uh, Scott Chan from the stadium uh, authority or the stadium uh, manager and myself got on the phone with Peter Dropik. He's the number two at UFC, right under Dana White. And he conveyed to us uh, a very different scenario that he was very, very interested in having a fight here in Hawaii. And to really capitalize on the popularity of Max Holloway, this year's schedule has been booked up, so we can't get in before the end of 2017. But he was very receptive to the idea of bringing a UFC fight here next year, spring or summer of next year, and have Max Holloway be the headliner for that, uh, that card. As far as the rain goes, is, is there something that Aloha State has been talking with the UFC about the concerns about the, the rain and the, the outdoor event? Yes, I think that uh, perhaps that was Dana White posturing, that in fact, the stadium can put a canopy over the ring and, and, and its fans. They did that, in fact, in 2005 when there was a K-1 fight featuring BJ Penn. 12,000 people were there. I don't know if it rained or not, but it, it, it was a very successful event uh, 12 years ago. Now, is this something that HTA is interested in, or are they fully in on bringing a UFC event to Hawaii? I was very surprised that HTA's initial reaction was they were not interested in the fight for two reasons. They thought that it would attract the undesirables here. Hooligans and people of mischief are going to come here. And the second reason that they said that they were not interested was because, it, in their opinion, it didn't fit with the brand imaging of Hawaii being a family, wholesome destination. Uh, but when you look at the numbers, UFC fans uh, stay longer than your typical uh, tourist to a, lo a locale, and they spend a lot more. So from an economic standpoint, I think it makes a lot of sense to bring them here. HTA is supposed to be the driver for economic growth. They are not the measure of morality and ethics in, th in the state of Hawaii. I would think that they would want to, to fund this particular event. Dana White also told us Max Holloway will fight Frankie Edgar later this year. For more on a link to our five-minute interview with White, you can swing by our website, khon2.com.